So I just finished recording a two week post radiation update. So I figured I would just do a quick reply to you. It's been two weeks. I had 20 rounds. Uh, four of those rounds were boosters and I didn't burn. Um, it, it got really pink. Um, I do have the common pink square that goes into the bottom half of my armpit and comes down at an angle down my ribs under my breast. Um, but as somebody who sunburns even on a cloudy day, I was super, super uh, hesitant and nervous to do radiation, but I got through it okay and I hope you do too. Um, I don't know if you've seen my other videos, but just a quick recap, I know if you ask 50 people what creams they used, you're probably gonna get 50 different answers. Um, my advice is go with your gut, use what you want, but use it religiously. And you might even start now. Uh, start moisturizing um, all of the area that they are going to radiate uh, morning and night leading up to your radiation day. And then once you start radiation, you can actually ask them where the beams will be hitting so that you can make sure you don't skip those parts. Uh, I have seen a lot of women in the breast cancer groups on Facebook not realize that they were going to have an exit spot of radiation on the back of their shoulder. So I was moisturizing back here before I asked them. Just to be safe, I was moisturizing back here. Little did I realize I was just doing a straight line basically of lotion down here. I was missing all of this area back here and the lower half of my armpit. So you can actually ask your radiation team when you start where the beams will hit so that you can make sure you're moisturizing those spots and hydrate, hydrate, hydrate. If you are dehydrated, your skin is gonna be more dry and you'll be more prone to burning and your skin won't be able to heal as quickly because it is dry. So make sure you're drinking lots of water or Gatorade or whatever gets you through the day, but make sure you are hydrating and staying hydrated through radiation. So I hope that helps and I hope you get through it without burning as well. Um, I also found something out through the breast cancer group. I will post a screenshot instead of trying to read it to you. Uh, but I thought that was really helpful and interesting as well. So um, yeah, I just hope that helps and I hope you get through it okay. All right, love you, talk to you later, bye.